Coach, good morning. Today we're going to talk about something that's very common in the sport of swimming and not so common in water polo, maybe a common in other aquatic sports, um, diving, anything that takes so much training, so much time, artistic swimming, just hours and hours of dedication. And to be the most elite, the most elite, you have to train from a very young age. And the huge thing that happens is, and we all know what it's called, burnout. Burnout is huge and it's a big problem. So how are you going to solve it, right? Because when it comes to you making money as a coach, you have to solve the problem of burnout. If you're not solving the problem of burnout, you get churn. What's churn? Churn is literally you losing clients and having to pick up new clients to replace them. The idea, and we talked about this earlier, is you want to have a lifetime value where you get someone at a very young age and then you continue to build upon that and you keep having them till they're at least 18. And they come, maybe come back to you after college. Maybe they even work for you after college. It's a huge advantage that you have to increase that lifetime value. Burnout is a huge problem. Now, <clears throat> with our company, Making Money Coaching Sports, we have different aspects to help you build and make sure that you don't achieve, you know, you achieve this actual building and learning and getting people more involved with our promotions program, things that are going to help you gain more confidence and make sure that you are giving the best value to your clients. We have that in our accelerator program. All you have to do is text me at the bottom or shoot me an email and I'll be more than glad to talk to you about it. Burnout is huge. How are we going to stop it? Well, I'm kind of biased because I played water polo and I did swimming. And so I think any sort of blending of aquatics is huge. So you can blend any of the aquatics. You can blend diving, you can blend artistic swimming, water polo, um, swimming, anything that you can do to break up the monotony of that athlete. If you're able to parse it out, there's a huge, there's this little window that I think is a huge window for kids. And for some um, reason, it happens to boys more than girls in terms of the burnout um, that happens at this age between the ages of about 11, 12 to about 14, 15 is when these boys are getting into high school and they're seeing other sports and they're exposed to other sports. And maybe the swimming aquatics program is not huge at their school. It's not popular. It's not a thing they want to do. They want to go play football or basketball or baseball, which is all great. But if you want to keep them in your aquatics program, you have to blend the both and give them more options. Maybe they don't train five days a week with you anymore. Maybe they only train two days a week with you and then they go play baseball, okay? But you want to keep them in your program at some form or fashion, okay? If you want to keep the boys, I highly suggest if you're a swim coach, you pair up with a water polo coach. That is going to be huge for you. You're going to keep those boys interested, okay? On the girls' side, the burnout usually occurs later, probably 14, 15, 16, when they've just swam so many yards, they just don't want to do anything anymore, so how are you going to retain that girl swimmer? Okay, artistic swimming could be a huge option a couple times a week. Diving, you know, diving is really hard to get into, but that could be an option. Or again, you could have them do water polo. Something where you're blending the swimming with a team sport is huge. Okay, we can help you at Making Money Coaching Sports broaden your horizon so that you can actually get a better base for you to spread that out with your athletes. Okay. Again, if you'd like help with that, contact me. If you want any more questions about how to help with burnout, I can answer those questions too. Anything that you want to do, let's talk about it. Let's make it better for all the kids in our programming, provide more value. Have a great day.